Okay, hello from me and my Pempo. So today we are going to be hiking Mount Makulot and I've actually been looking forward to this because this is something I've been wanting to start for quite some time. It's like a hiking series vlog where basically I just hike different mountains here in the Philippines. So let's get started. I'm already running out of breath. We, have, we haven't even started. Okay. Uh, life lessons. <laughs> one-fourth of the hike according to Kuya. So far so good. Are you guys good? Good. Good. <laughs> Kelly, good? You're good? <laughs> I believe in you. I almost died. <laughs> On camera. I'm very so good at it if I fell. <laughs> Funny. Yeah, it's not funny. It's not. What can you say about the hack? Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, you know? <laughs> no, I mean, it's a little hard because it's uphill. Um, it's not a flat hike. It's, ve it's very much uphill. There's lots of pushing yourself uh, up. That's the hardest part. It's very strenuous. Let's go! <laughs> In general, it's pretty damn hard. But attempting to vlog glass, and hike glass. at the same time, what am I even doing? <laughs> Come on, Kelly! Get to the Rockies. Let's go! Let's go. Rockies, and this is where the iconic IG photo is taken. Prepping to go back down. Uh, won't be shooting, so this it's the same. It's the same trail. So, you ready to go back down? <laughs> no. <laughs> The hike is coming to an end and we're gonna end the hike with the befo before and after pic. So before we went up <laughs> and after. We made it, we're alive! <laughs> we made it! Okay, so just got back from the hike. It's actually been like two hours or so because we drove out to this place. I'll get to that in a bit. I just want to talk about the hike overall. Honestly, I don't have much to say because it was a good hike. It was 
um, a short hike that turned into a really long hike. Um, it was supposedly like an hour or two, but with us, it became like almost five. five. five to six. Yeah, five to six. To think that there's a five to six hour hike. Imagine if we, we had gotten that, we'd probably, yeah, it would probably take us 10 hours. Anyway, my tip is to just bring gloves, okay? Gloves are so essential because you're gonna do so much climbing. You're gonna touch so many things with your hands. There are lots of ropes, so you're gonna be holding on to that. So there are times where you do get rope burn because like you're holding on and then you slip because there's lots of loose soil. So you end up slipping and then like you're, you know, there's friction between your hand and the rope. You're gonna need to hold on to a lot, a lot, a lot of things so yes gloves second thing is to just prepare because um my friends and i we aren't exactly uh prepared athletically i mean we haven't worked out in forever and doing this hike was just a little challenging because everything was uphill and we thought that going down would be easier but it turns out it was actually a little harder i mean going up was hard because you were pushing yourself up but then going back down was kind of like trying not to slip and die because again there's lots of loose soil so basically the entire way down we could have just like crawled on the floor so yeah that that's pretty much that um we drove we drove to the mountain to the to a site so yeah there's parking uh, all you have to do is pay 50 pesos after parking the car you're gonna get a guide and then he's just gonna guide you from there so yeah right now i am at this place called domescape so i'm gonna turn that into a completely separate video so stay tuned for that so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video like this video if you enjoyed it subscribe if you haven't already follow me at bianca miguel and i will see you in the next video